Hi, I'm Andy Bellamy from AJA and you're joining us at NAB 2017 and I'm here to talk to you a little bit about some of the new announcements we made this year. Now one of the things that's sort of happening everywhere and you'll hear this a lot as you go around NAB or watching the news reports like this one from NAB is HDR. Now HDR is a, a fantastic way of bringing all that wonderful dynamic range that modern cameras can record and taking that all the way to the viewer for the home viewing experience. So high dynamic range is really a buzz everywhere. And there's a number of different ways of doing that at the moment, like any new format. There's hybrid log gamma, there's HDR10, of course there's things like Dolby Vision as well. And then there are sub iterations of those formats as well. So in this nascent period as these formats are jostling, we felt it was really prescient to try and bring to our customers, our partners, products which can help you see the quality of the original hybrid log gamma footage or HDR10 footage and bring it to your monitor in the correct format. Now we've got a lot of converters, you know us for those things, frame synchronizers and so on. So one of the things we've been showing here is our Hi-Fi 4K Plus. Now this gives us high frame rate HDR monitoring. We're really thrilled and uh, very proud to show some of the footage from Planet Earth 2 shot by the BBC. Now this was all shot as hybrid log gamma, it's, so it's a HDR footage itself. And we have our new Keeper Ultra Plus over here, which is just playing it back. It's a UHD ProRes 422HQ file. So a really good quality file of a nice size. And it's hybrid log gamma. Now the Keeper Ultra Plus doesn't know what that is as it comes out of the HDMI or the 3G SDIs. But by using a Hi-Fi 4K Plus in line and also using the mini config software, we can set the correct gamma curve for the way out so we can monitor it correctly and see that footage in all its glory at home or in the edit suite. <laughs>